from the burning bush, O oh Lord. You charged me to bring the people to this holy mountain to behold your glory and receive your law. What have I left undone? And they overlaid the image with pure gold. And Aaron fashioned it and smoothed it with the hammer, ready to be graven by cunning art and man's device. And he fastened it with nails that it should not move. And he that smote the anvil did beat the molten gold into thin plates. For they had gathered their treasure into the midst of the furnace and did blow the fire upon it to melt it. And they adorned themselves in rich apparel and costly array with veils of blue and purple and scarlet and fine twined linen wrought in Egypt. And the women tread grapes from Midian into new wine. Thou shalt not take the name of the Lord thy God in vain. the people sinned a great sin, for they had made them a god of gold. And they bore him upon their shoulders and rejoiced, saying, This be our God, O Israel. Are you mourners of Moses afraid to face the new god of gold? They were as children who had lost their faith. They were perverse and crooked and rebellious against God. They did eat the bread of wickedness and drank the wine of violence. And they did evil in the eyes of the Lord. And the people cried, The graven image hath brought us joy. And they worshipped the golden calf and sacrificed unto it. Here is your sacrifice! They
written with the finger of God.